Hi guys, I'm Mary. Thank you for joining me. Here's an update what's going on with Yellowstone. We've got a current image of Old Faithful just finishing going off. Yeah, it's been raining there today and it's only about 38 degrees. Tonight it's supposed to be about 26 degrees. USGS is reporting only 47 earthquakes so far for the last week. Uh, the largest being a magnitude 2.4 that was on the 24th and then a 2.3 on the 24th. The most recent that they're reporting is a magnitude 0 0.6, but it was not a magnitude 0 0.6. Using the IRIS swarm program, here we have borehole 950, which is the Norris Geyser Basin. In the middle is West Thumb. And over here we have Mary Lake. If you look at the bottom, the bottom line of the data, way below the spectrogram and all the other data, you'll see the MD. It was a, it actually was a magnitude 1.28. This was caused by magma intrusion pushing up on the crust of the earth there. Um, it came in between uh, 1 hertz and 10 hertz. You can see the harmonic tremors here. Here's the monitor for Mary Lake. You can see at the bottom MD uh, 1.34. I made the signature larger for you. Here you can see we had blobs, what they call blobs of magma that came into the system. Yeah, and it's harmonic tremors. See that? Mary Lake for years have been showing harmonic tremors um, as the earthquakes come in. This is a larger section of what we got down up there. Here's that same signature, but as it came in at Little West Thumb. Harmonic signature. The top here, we have the borehole for Yellowstone Lake. The middle is Mary Lake. And this is Little West Thumb. Many geologists say when you start seeing harmonic tremors across the park, yeah, you better wake up and take notice. Well, Yellowstone's been recharging for about 6,000 years for another eruption. There was other very small earthquakes. Uh, this one here at 1318 USGS did not report. This one here was a magnitude 2. Point zero seven. There's its spectrogram. You can see at the bottom the uh, first line here. If I move it, it'll disappear, but it says MD 2.07. Again, harmonic tremors. It's not quite 1 hertz, but it's all the way up to 10 hertz. Once again, harmonic tremors all together. This is uh, the monitor, bo the borehole 950. Mary Lake in the center, and Little West Thumb at the bottom. Here's an example just to show you how this program does work right. USGS is reporting at 1930 a 1.2. Well, I got to bring it down a little bit for you. Just to show you how this program does work right, USGS is reporting a magnitude 1.2 at 1930. It actually is a 1.24. They left off the 2.4. But you can see it down there at the bottom, 1.24. That comes from borehole 950. Here we have it in the middle for West Thumb and Mary Lake. And we'll go to the spectrogram. Yeah, they leave off quite a few earthquakes. So they did not report that magnitude 2.07. They, yeah, they just completely decided not to report that one. Here's another one, this one right here. Now this one's supposed to be a, a 2.7. This one too came in at a uh, little west thumb. It's got a P wave on it as a 2.07 also. That's got a longer P wave on it. So it was farther away. All right, so we got another one marked in red right here. At 8.50 Universal Time, that's at West Thumb. It doesn't really show up. Or at Mary Lake. That's that one right there. And it comes in as a 1.66. That one too is not being reported. Yeah, and for some reason there was a lot of data 
uh, missing. Uh, we got one, two, three, four, five hours of data missing here. So we got another one here at 729 not being reported. That one came in as a 1.66. We got another one right here. That one came in as a 1.52. This other one not being reported right here is a 1.70. This next one right here marked in red. Uh, that one came in as a 1.71. This next one came in as a 1.74. And there is a lot more that you can see there's, there's small ones here. But this is the 1.74 that's not being reported at um, 8.57 Universal Time. This one here a little bit earlier at 2.38. That one came in as a 1.52. I'll show you the signature of that one. And let's do this if I can. Here we got um, the borehole. 9.50 at the top. You can see the, the time, 2.38. Mary Lake and Little West Thumb, yeah, harmonic tremors. And then the very first one of the data stream that I pulled, this one came in as a 1.42. I'll show you the uh, spectrogram there. This is what they would consider a microquake. There's a signature as it came in at borehole 950. And this is Mary Lake. And we'll show yeah, <laughs> yeah, look at that. That's a sine wave there at Mary Lake. And this is a spectrogram. Yeah, harmonic tremors. Look how even that is. And it's between 1 and 10 hertz. Harmonic tremors are generally between 1 and 10 hertz. For those of you that do not know what harmonic tremors are, a harmonic tremor is a sustained release of seismic and infrasonic energy. Typically associated with the underground movement of magma, the venting of volcanic gases, yes, these do pick up the sound of the gases from magma, or both. And that comes from Wikipedia. This image here comes from USGS. Here we got tectonic-like earthquakes. Shallow volcanic earthquakes. See how it's evenly going up and down pretty much? And harmonic tremors. Up and down, very even. Mary Lake's been showing this signature for many years now. All right, USGS says there was a magnitude 1.5 there by Hedden Lake at 120 and 38 seconds. It actually looks like two earthquakes. We'll check it out. Here we got 120. 120, this is um, the borehole, 950. Little West Thumb and Mary Lake. The spectrogram. So which one would you say is larger? Either at Mary Lake. At Yellowstone Lake, it comes in as a 1.84. And at Mary Lake, it comes in as a 2.0. They've been having a lot of twos and they're not reporting them. Those of you that have been following what's going on with Yellowstone know um, Hank Hessler got his butt in trouble when he reported that um, if and when Yellowstone started having magnitude 2 earthquakes that the geologists would be very concerned and that's been going on for a little bit lately. There's a spectrogram and I'm making the wave signature larger is what I'm doing so we can see it better because it's so small. All right there it is. Again harmonic tremors. When I did a report on the earthquake activity in Hawaii, I noticed one of the signatures was way off where they said it was located. Um, yeah, this one's way off. Mary Lake is, let me find it for you. All right, here's Mary Lake using Google Earth, and I'll bring this out for you. Yeah, that's my grandson. This is Yellowstone Lake, and over here is Hedman Lake. We go back to Mary Lake, right up over here. Yeah, my program's acting up for Google Earth. I wanted to zoom in on it again. All 
So that's all I have for you right now. Any thoughts or comments or questions, please put it down below. Thank you for watching. Uh, thank you for subscribing. If you're not subscribed, please make sure you subscribe. Make sure the bell is uh, clicked on so you can get notices when I make videos. I'm also on Twitter and I'm also on Patreon if you wish to support my work. Thank you very much, you guys, for watching. Please stay safe and I'll talk to you later. God bless you all.